In this problem, we're going to take two six-sided dice and we're going to roll them. And we want the probability of getting snake eyes. So snake eyes means that we get uh, ones on both dice. So let's go ahead and write that down. So this is the probability that uh, the first die is a one and uh, the other die, the second die, is a one. So if we're rolling two dice, uh, snake eyes means they're both ones. So we can think of that as the first being a one and the second being a one. And the reason we did this, the reason this is important is because now we see, we are aware that the word and is here and and means multiply. So this means that the first is a one times and then probability second is a one. So we want them both to uh, be ones. So let's go ahead and work out these probabilities. So for the first die to be a one, uh, it's a fraction. In the numerator, it's the number of ways for the die to land on one. Well, there's only one way for the die to land on one. It lands on one. Divided by the number of ways for the die to land. So there are six sides on the die. So there are six ways for the die to land. So again, the probability of getting a one is the number of ways for the die to land on one divided by the number of ways for the die to land times the same thing, so it's also one over six. So you have a fraction times a fraction, so you just multiply across the numerator and denominator, so you get one times one, which is one, and six times six, which is 36, which is the probability of getting snake eyes. I hope this video has been helpful.